arrogance, foolishness, pride, all the above. I went to prison over 10 bucks. Okay? I went to prison. I went to prison over a movie ticket. My name is Glover, aka Second Chance, aka Little Ballerina. Hi, I'm Jarvis, aka Madagascar. I like to move it, move it. We like to move it, move it. We like to move it, move it. My name's Kevin, uh, aka Barbie Girl. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Yes, yes you are. Yeah. Hi, my name's Tim, aka Governor Rick Cherry, and I have three issues. If you don't have your heart ready before you get here, you might as well stay where you're at because this is a place of transformation. Mm -hmm. And transformation and change, you know, it's, it, re it requires a person to go in it wholeheartedly. I've been incarcerated for 18 years and I, uh, I can't see myself giving no more of my life back to the state. You know what I'm saying? And PEP has helped me to break that shell. Um, but it wasn't until I went to prison that, you know, People, men made themselves available to me in the form of executive volunteers, chaplains, um, and they saw, they're seeing something that, that Max saw, that my father-in-law saw, and I'm not getting it. And I think I'm getting that. It's, it, it wasn't anything special. It wasn't anything special. And it's something that everybody has, and it's a value of life. I basically overcome a lot, a lot of uh, struggles as far as like I've got the most homework, period, than anybody's got. When you sell something, they give you homework, right? So I got the most homework, and that's why everybody quits on it. And I, I try to explain to people that it's not in my nature to quit. Nobody understands that. It's like I want to do the impossible, and people like that. You know? and they're like, I know I can't get all this homework done in time. I can't. It's impossible. But the point is. I believe that like being able to come through this program has shown me a lot and, and has given, given me a lot of growth and a lot of understanding about myself and about all the mistakes that I was actually doing. Because uh, it, it was always usually about me, you know, I can always control the situation, I can always do what I can regardless and I never actually came in touch with my own character that, you know, I always thought it's like, I'm not the problem, everybody else is the problem, if they just leave me alone I'd be great. But I never actually opened my eyes to see that the things that I was doing was the one that was causing me and my, my family members and the other people around me harm. Are you tired of those places that they said they're original, but they're really not? Are you tired of the same taste of the same food of this, same places? Do you want something different, fresh? An art and skill practiced in our family for decades will ensure dependability originality, and experience on any project, whether residential or commercial. Our services will first be offered in the Houston area and soon the South Texas region. Competitors out there, but there are very few good guys. I mean, I, I, we, we, we've done lots of ceramic projects, and you know, I, I can think of the one that did the phenomenal job that I would call every time and pay a premium to, just because the quality is so outstanding. There's a lot of folks that can slap up tile. Yeah. So I think there's a premium to be had for doing it right. You can choose to be affected by the world, or you can choose to affect it. I know what I'm doing, and I know what we're doing. And my question to, to y'all is, what are y'all going to do?
Cut short.